Hello Pisces, watchers, cross watchers, everyone is welcome. Thank you for stopping by. My name is Donna and this is Irish Donna Tarot. The overall energy in this reading for you Pisces is me talks, repairing the body, mind and spirit. Um, we also see the energy of crown games, the right use of power in relationship is an incredibly important asset. We also see that you're going through a very confusing time. Galactic mushroom, divine matrix. So there are definitely things that you want to figure out for your stability in love. Your person's thoughts, feelings, intentions, and actions start out with they want a victory with you in healing something that has wounded you. Uh, the relationship, you know, they definitely think of you as somebody who's smart, who's victorious. Uh, they also think of you as someone who's been through a bit of a rough time here, a rough patch in terms of what's going on in your life. They feel very much that you're balanced, the Justice card, Libra energy. They feel as though you have done or had to put up with a situation in your life that you want to leave behind, Pisces. So your person feels as though you're discontented. They think of you as being discontented. They also think of you as their soulmate. So they definitely, this looks like a relationship, Pisces. It's been, you know, in your energy for a while while now but we see this beautiful energy of uh, Archangel Raphael protecting the relationship and that is how your person sees you they see you as someone who is divinely protected in terms of their heart space they absolutely love you the Empress card is nurturing its Venus its love it's everything to do with everything that they value they see you again seven of wands they see you in a time in your life that and they love that you can defend yourself <clears throat> they love that you can stick up for yourself your person wants to make an offer in their heart space they feel conflicted about making an offer because they see you as someone as a queen of pentacles they see you as someone who is completely capable of taking care of themselves with the empress the nine of pentacles you know now we have the emperor you know the empress card is here saying that you bring everything to the table they adore you they love you they definitely feel like you don't need them and that you're single ready to mingle so in terms of their intentions with you, they know it's time to make a decision, that it's time, the timing is right to take a leadership role in this relationship, to move forward very quickly and share what they've invested, what they want, what their goals are in the relationship. When it comes to the outcome cards, in terms of their actions, we see the judgment card. They are releasing this sort of poverty mindset. Your person is very much feeling as though if the two of you were to part ways, it would be very devastating to them. They feel very much in terms of their actions that they need to release the the energy that holds them back from doing better financially for themselves. They feel that you're very solid and in this relationship that if they want things to manifest to meet their desires, that they need to earn more money, they need to bring more to the table financially. And that is their goal. We see the lover's card here. We see the lover's card there, Gemini energy. We have Libra, Gen uh, Gemini. I don't see an Aquarius energy, but we have the energy of, you know, this, the Four of Cups. We have Cancer, that's Scorpio. We have the Seven of Wands, which is um, Leo energy. A lot of Leo energy, too. The Two of Wands, you know, making a decision, Aries energy. So you basically have most of the energies here on the board. I don't see a lot of, I'm, I'm not seeing Capricorn energy. So your person doesn't seem to have that quite grounded stability, Pisces. Um, but we see your person is feeling very much that you're the one for them, that they're just not sure some of the practical matters in the relationship are calling for growth, expansion. You know, there's this whole feeling that the two of you are learning. So your person really wants you in their life. They're going to to do whatever they have to. They're going to release, let go, move forward with you um, in terms of that 10 of coins. That's a 
That's a marriage card that is all about having a legacy marriage till death do us part. The justice card can indicate a marriage license, uh, but your person knows that something needs to be released and it's this feeling left out in the cold, this energy that they that they have with their actions that you know they need to start letting go of. I think, again, more of a, a mindset here. So let's look and see what the energy is around the relationship for you, for how you feel about this Pisces. How do you feel about this person and what they bring to the table? They seem to feel inadequate sometimes, or they feel as though large changes need to take place. But your person's in it to win it, Pisces. Your person wants you. They want the relationship. They're waiting for you to do something here. Um, in terms of how you feel. So let's see, Pisces, where are you at with this? Well, you, there's Aquarius energy. You see your person as a rock star. You see them as highly desirable. They, You feel as though you have a good collaborative working uh, relationship. When you're very logical about it, you're very comfortable with the passion, the fire, you know, what both of you bring, the equal give and take. We see the energy that you have, some things that you really would like to talk to this person about, some of the insecurities or the things that you're sensing in this relationship. So in terms of the outcome, we see that you really are invested in the relationship. You feel your person has some things to figure out for themselves. They need to learn something or do something for themselves to feel better. The Seven of Wands, you know, very much defending the relationship. And the Six of Cups, very much wanting to be in this relationship. Soulmate energy, Scorpio energy. So it does look like your person is having some personal upheavals, but it does look like they you will work things out. So I'm going to leave it there. Pisces, send you love from Chicago. Send some back. I hope to see you in another video. And tell me where you're from. I would love to know. And I would love to know what you think of this sort of reading. Thanks. Bye-bye. Hope to see you soon.